Maple Leafs hosting the Rangers in a battle of the original six. The Rangers are plus 130 on the money line. The Maple Leafs are minus 155. The over-under is six goals. The Rangers getting a goal and a half are minus 195, while the Maple Leafs laying a goal and a half on the puck line are plus 162. Both of these teams won the last game that they played. Now head-to-head, -head, the home team is on a three-game winning streak. The Rangers are on a two-game winning streak against the Maple Leafs. The Rangers are 7-3 and three against the Maple Leafs in their last 10 meetings. The underdog is 7-3 and three on the money line. The underdog getting a goal and a half on the puck line is 8-2 and two getting a goal and a half. There have been four one-goal games in their last 10 meetings. The home team is 6-4. and four. The over-under is 5-5, five and five, and the over-under at 6 is also 5-5. Five and five. The Rangers have been better on the road than they have been at home this year. They're 14-5-2-1. The Maple Leafs are 18-3-3-1 on the road, at home this year. Now, the last game that they played, the Rangers won 3-1. The game before that, the Rangers won 6-3. Both of those games were in New York. The game before that, the, uh, the Maple Leafs won 2-1 in Toronto. The game before that, the Rangers won 2-1 in Toronto. And the game before that, the Rangers won 5-3. The game before that, the Rangers won 5-4 in overtime in Toronto. So the Rangers have taken two out of the last three in Toronto, and they've taken five out of the last six games against the Maple Leafs. Now, in their last handful of games, we've gotten eight goals, four goals, four goals, and three goals, and that's for the Rangers. And if you average it out, because they've had two games where they've exploded offensively and two games where they've kind of scored one, you're looking at roughly two, two and a half, three goals a game, while the Maple Leafs have had seven goals, five goals, five goals, and nine goals. And the Maple Leafs are averaging at least four goals a game in the games that they've won. The game that they lost, they only scored two goals. So we've gotten two tails of two different teams. The Maple Leafs have also won six out of their last 10, and the Rangers have won seven out of their last 10. So this should be, for all intents and purposes, a very good game. I'm going to take the Rangers with the money line. I'm going to take the Rangers getting the goals. I'm going to go over in this game, although I probably shouldn't. These are just my picks. If you disagree, please go with your gut and please bet responsibly.